Hey guys, it's me, Sierra P or C Pierre. Coming back to you guys with another video. Um, based on the title, you know I'm gonna be doing what's in my makeup bag slash makeup chest because my makeup is like not in like an actual bag. But yeah, so hope you like it and let's get started. Get my <laughs> okay, so first I'm gonna show you guys the type of bag and chest. I have my makeup in two separate things. The first one, okay, I'm trying to close it. Because <laughs> I just finished doing my makeup. First one is this Victoria's Secret makeup bag. It opens out in four. Look, it's really like a whole bunch of mess in here. But it opens out into, it rolls out and it's like four different sections. So, let's start. And I also have and then I also have this um, makeup chest. It's a makeup chest. Actually. And it opens out and has like two different sides or whatever. Okay, let's start with the Victoria's Secret bag. In this one, oh my god, I need to cut that out the camera. At first, I have my professional, professional pro bomb to minimize the appearance of pores by benefit. I use this put on my face before I put on my foundation then it's all over the place right now I have to organize it uh, over then I have my happy hour super shock cheek matte by Colourpop in the color 5k02 this is just what it looks like and then this is like one section of the one two three four four fold makeup bag that I have and then I have some LA Girl Pro Concealers. I have the color um, Warm Honey and Fawn that is not open yet because I'm still trying to squeeze the little bit I have out of the other one that I have that's almost done. And then I have my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in the color Ebony. I think, um, I'm not sure, I think this is one of the darkest ones. Ooh, my cat's fur is like all, all over me. Then I have this black opal concealer that concealer uh, concealer that I used to use. I don't really use it anymore. Maybe I should dump it. And then um, I feel like my head looks like it's like two toned. Then I have my NYX Auto Eyebrow Pencil that I do not use anymore in the color. Brown. Then I have my setting spray that I just got from H and M. Brow shaping gel. It says setting spray. Gel, gel, eyebrow gel. <laughs> it's a setting, setting like gel for your brows or whatever. I just got this from H and M like a, a couple months ago. I use that sometimes. Like sometimes I just forget to set my brows or whatever. And then I have my spoolie. And my blending brush that I used to blend with everything. And I got both of these from a set that my mom got at Rite Aid that I stole from her. <laughs> it was a set of this and another blending brush that I used to blend out my, um, I used to blend my contour and my highlight. I got this Master Cajal by Maybelline. Let me tell you about this. I got this thinking it was black because in the box it was this color. Like black like this clip it showed on this box on the box I open it it's like gray this is gray this is not black it's gray I don't use this I put it on one time and I just smudged it all over my eye and made it into a freaking eyeshadow because honestly I was over it <sighs> then I got my other Anastasia dip brow pomade in medium brown I actually have to restore that one when you guys tell me I could restore it with like olive oil so I'm gonna use I'm gonna try that um, and then I have the other brush that I got in the set from Rite Aid. Oh, freak. Okay, so we're going to go into the other section that I have. My cat is looking at me because she likes to be over here in this area. But when I'm filming, I cannot move her from here. And then just now, she just freaking like scratched the crap out of my foot. Oh, let me know what you guys do when your cats act up, if you have cats. 
or any pets for that matter. Then in the next one, I have this, damn, it didn't rub though. It was a, no, 3D Face Creator by, I'm freaking out what this is by, Ruby Kisses? Ruby Kisses, my grandmother gave to me. And I still use it sometimes. It's kind of jacked up right now, but you know. I use it too much. Now let me stop. But yeah, um, yeah, she gave that to me one time. I went, we went to Maryland to see some of our relatives and I didn't have no concealer because I was just starting out with my makeup. Look at that. A shame. These edges, girl. All right, let me just pull this down. Um, yeah, I didn't have any, um, concealer so so I didn't have any concealer I didn't have any concealer so I had to use that and it was really cool like I don't mind it was really good it blended well and it kind of well it did fit my skin complexion I don't know why I stopped using it because I found fawn next is fawn the one that I'm actually using it's like almost done if you guys can see that like it's clear see nothing um I have that and then I have my other one that's not open LA girl pro concealer in the color mahogany I have yet to use it I don't know I'm debating if I should use it or give it away because honestly I, f I haven't used it yet but I feel like it looks like it's gonna be too dark for me then I have one of these brushes that I got from got it from Rite Aid in a set one of these brushes. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it before. They're like in almost every Rite Aid, Rite Aid I've been to. Then I have uh, track glue because I was on um, Aaliyah J's page and she told me she told me, yeah, because she, she only speaks to me. She was saying that she uses this because the duo gel doesn't work for her, the duo glue. And I'm like it don't work for me either, girl. So maybe I need to try this. It still don't work. Maybe I'm just doing something wrong. Like I said, I will be making a video on how not to apply eyelashes because I never can. Then I have this. Uh, I don't like to throw things away. Then I have this almost empty foundation by Makeup Forever Ultra HD that I don't use anymore because it's damn near done. In the color. In the color. Why was I about to say professional power, powers? And that's not it. In the color Y505. That's my color and makeup. Forever HD foundation. Let's get on with this. Now I have my beauty blender that I have to clean. I have this finishing powder by NYX that I bought that I don't really use anymore because when I take pictures, it makes me look super white. Then I have, yo, this mascara, yo. I got this in an Ipsy, my Ipsy bag for, oh, shit. For last month, I got it, and um, it's bomb.com. Mascara I got from my Ipsy Glam Bag from last month. It's called, it's by Smashbox, and it's called X-Rated Mascara Vol Volumator. Let me just show you. This is really good. I love it. Love it. Love, love, love. I love it because, like, I have no lashes. And it makes me look like I have lashes. The only thing though, when I'm removing it from my face with my, um, this hair is in my face too much. When I'm removing it with my micellar cleansing water, it starts to burn. And my it gets in my eye, it starts to burn. And I'm just not with it. Just like I'm not with this hair right now. So let me pull this back. Like I was saying, it burns my eyes, so yeah. I still use it though because it's bomb.com. I just use it and when I'm taking the wall, I pray to God it doesn't burn me. Hello. And that's about it in this section. And they can come apart. The, the little things that comes in the thing, it comes apart so I can clean it. I always clean it. But I was just finished doing my makeup. So right now. Um, and the other one, the last one, I have my highlight. I had it. I didn't put on a lot today. I have it in a Ziploc bag because it broke. And I'm just too lazy to go to Rite Aid and get another one. But this highlighter is bomb.com. Um, it's the Lumi True Match by L'Oreal Power Glow 
illuminator in the color 50m triple girl it's really good it's really pigmented i don't put on a lot today because i was just trying to get something done to my face so i can come on camera for y'all and then i have this other i have two more la girl pro concealers i have the one in dark cocoa then I have one in uh, then I have one in medium beige so that's cool and then I have this oh my god this volume volume is my phone ringing? oh how can my phone be ringing then I have this um, custom color lip plumper by Victoria's Secret I don't know if it plumped the lips cause I don't really like watch it that much to like see the results I don't know if it really does what it says it's supposed to do but it I really feel it working so maybe it does I just don't see it because my lips are a good size already honestly and then I have this concealer by covergirl ready set gorgeous it's super light for me I don't know why the hell I got this it's like this is not me dude this is like four shades lighter than my skin complexion then I just have my eyebrow eyebrow brush that I used to <gasps> fill in them brows girl okay I'm gonna put these back in her I'm gonna put these back in here and then I'm gonna get to my chest and I'm gonna start with one of the sections it just it's a um makeup chest that came with makeup so I kept this one because I really like it my grandmother gave it to me shout out to you grandma you the real MVP because it's really good I really like these shades they're really pigmented I use them sometimes so all all the things I have on top are my lips I have my MAC lipstick in Instigator. I have another MAC lipstick. Is this the one? No, this is not it. Where's my other one? I have another MAC lipstick that I, I don't know, the color where it wore off, but this is the color. And Instigator is purple, like a vampire purple. Super cute, my nigga, my nigga. Then I have this tart lip thing that I got was it ipsy i think either ipsy or the essence box no this was ipsy this tart tart lip surgeons wonder lip cream and i got an ipsy then i have my color pop my other color pop that i have on my lips are on so i have my two black color pop lip products i have the lippy stick and Bold Chick, and I also have the lip liner for Bold Chick. It's just, um, just black. Then I have Limbo by ColourPop. Limbo by ColourPop. And then I have, thank you. Then I have my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in, in Transylvania. This is also a dark purple. Then I have my uh, grunge matte lippy stick. I lost them, um, the liner, honestly. I don't think I lost it. I think it's just somewhere in here. And then I also have my MAC Vamplify, uh, what do I call it? Lip gloss. It's red and it's called Don't Touch. It's, it's called Tease, Don't Touch. Hey. <laughs> Then I have my um, Vivid Rose. Uh, is this L'Oreal? I think this is L'Oreal. It doesn't even say Maybelline. Uh huh. Lipstick in Vivid Rose. This is one of the vivid colors. Then I have this Kiss lipstick that I stole from somebody. I, I don't use it anymore. Then I got this concealer that I got in the Ipsy bag. Oh my God. It's so smooth and it's so creamy. Come on, focus focus it's so creamy so creamy it's called boo boo cover up but it's too light for me so even if I do use it I'm gonna have to put on another I'm gonna have to put on a layer of foam on top of it which is too much cake up on my face especially in the summertime then I have my other Maybelline lipstick in divine wine it's really love this i don't really do like let's get on to the other fun lip 
I have a whole bunch of lipsticks. <laughs> you know, I had to get some Jeffree Star, girl. I have um, Posh Spice and I have I'm Nude. Girl, if you don't know about Jeffree Star, you need to go and get you some. I love Jeffree Star. I love him. I, I just love him. He's so passionate about what he does and I just inspire to be like him in the future honestly he's the bomb dot freaking calm then I have my NYX lingerie lip that I just got in what? I don't know what color is this honestly lace detail girl I love it I love it I love it I love it that's it I love it I got this the other day from the new Nick store that opened in KP in Brooklyn. Yes, y'all need to go and find that. Then my ultimate favorite lip that I wear with almost everything is Yash. It's a matte by MAC. Love it. It's ultimate nude. It's my favorite favorite nude. Kind of looks like um, lace detail. Wait, yeah, lace detail. Did I? No. Not lace detail. I didn't swatch this yet. Did I? Did I swatch this, girl? Yeah, I'm bugging out. I so did. Yeah, it looks like lace detail. Then I got. I did this already, right? No, then I have another Maybelline lipstick from the same section called Nude Embrace. It's a matte. Then I have another NYX Soft Matte um, in the color Buenos Aires, which is good afternoon, I believe, in Spanish. Then I have this Haraki. Haraki. You are the palm highlighter that I got in an Essence box. Essence or Ipsy. One of those. And it's so pretty. And it's so pigmented. I love it. Let me just. Look at that. Look at that. I love it. It's bomb.com. Then, okay, we're done with this side. Then I have my L'Oreal Mercier setting powder. Um, the sponge just fell out, but this is what I use to set my face sometimes. And then I have, damn, where's all my brushes? Freak. One of them is in the bathroom, but I have my Real Cosmetics. Real Cosmetics, what the hell, Ciara? Real Technique brush set, minus these two. And the purple one, the eyeshadow brush, is in the bathroom, but... These were super cheap, and I love that the the stand, the um, the case turns into a stand. Can you please hush? Siblings. Then I have my foundation that I use now. It's Match Me Match Master SP Five Fifteen Foundation, Broad Spectrum by Mac in the color B eighty five. Then I have I feel like I don't have a lot of makeup. I need to get more. Then I have my contour cream kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills in the color medium. And I love this bad boy. <laughs> love it. Alright, it's time to get a little lighter, guys. I love this bad boy. I use it a lot, obviously. Um, yeah, and then I have my Kat Von D Kat Von D Shade Light Contour Palette. And I, honestly, I don't feel like, like a lot of people said it feel like it's for girls of color. I don't feel like it goes well with my skin complexion. Maybe it's just me. I just feel like it makes me look kind of ashy. Even the darks make me look kind of ashy. But I do use the, oh, it's messy in here. It is messy. I do use the dark one sometimes. I got to get a new one. To um set my, um after, to set my Anastasia Beverly Hills Cream Contour in the darkest one that I use on that palette. Then I have this face mask that I got in Ipsy. Girl. No, I'm lying. Not Ipsy. Essence box. This face mask. This is the last one. I had another one that was honey and another one that was pearls, I believe. It's, they really work really well. Then I have my Ben Nye Topaz Translucent Setting Powder. I use, I use this more because it doesn't make me look as ashy as the um, Laura Mercier. Then I have, oh, I found it, my grunge lippy stick. Eh. Get like me. I gotta, matter of fact, I gotta um, sharpen those. Then I have my other highlighter by Wet n Wild. Honey Bee. Let me show y'all. Let 
you see it oh. it's really good i love it it does what i need it to do then i have this um everything's falling then i have this lip lip balm stick that i got it's just you just twist it it's a twisty up and it is in the color elusive and sat insassible it's by covergirl then i have this nail polish that i ordered from mac that i have yet to use because i can't really have nail polish at, the job, at my work job <sighs> i hate it it's so cute it's just like the little foundation bottles it's maze balls i really like it i put it on my toes but so feening to put it on even to put it on my nails then i have this other one that i got from h&m it's an olive color again i can't wear it because of my job then i have this revlon color stay eyeshadow palette that i used to use all the time but now it's done like done i can't even open it like but look done hit pan on both of them then i have my real techniques text 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 then i have my real technique be blending sponge this shit is the bomb and then I have this blush thing that came with this whole like box and um you know I use it sometimes I don't really use blush because I feel like I don't really know how to apply it properly but you know contour highlight is fine I'm good with just that but um yeah so yeah it's good it's good it's good All right, and then I have my LA Girl Pro Prep High Definition Smoothing Face Primer. This one actually became a lot more like you know what a primer. I feel like almost every primer, if you apply too much, it's gonna start flaking. I feel like with this one, if you just pass it over once and then you like touch it again, it starts flaking. I don't really like that. Like that. I don't really like that. Like that. Like like. I don't really like that. Like that. So. I, I don't really use it but yeah um i feel like i don't have a lot of makeup that's it for this video well not for this video but for the things that i have in my makeup bag slash makeup chest i don't feel like i have a lot i feel like if i organize it i realize that i don't have a lot and i need to get a whole lot more i need to learn how to put on lashes i need to jeffrey cosmetics i have to i love jeffrey cosmetics honestly like love 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 oh i forgot to say this this other lip thing that i got from ipsy is called be a bombshell and it's in the color secret come on I hate that it doesn't freaking focus but yeah um it's in the color secret and i actually have it in the middle of my lip i love it love 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 but yeah so that's all for this video like subscribe comment share if you guys want to see more comment below let me know how you feel about this video um request some videos under this video um follow me on twitter instagram all that good stuff um and let me know what you guys want to see because i am doing this to please you guys because i really don't have anything else to do i love makeup so why not let you guys know what i do i will start vlogging as soon as i get a proper camera right now i'm only using my phone because i just have yet to get camera and lights and all that stuff but i will start vlogging once i get a proper camera and all that so that should be fun i'm excited to go on this journey with youtube and with you guys and yeah hope to see you soon